Hey guys, so today, um, the guitar wall mounts came, um, a day early, which is, I don't know, alright, I guess. Um, so, they came, and along with that, because I've got two of you, so, um, they're just, um, so you can mount your guitars on the wall and hang them off, so, that, because that's what I'm doing, if you didn't see my last video of me setting up this rack, put a link in the description, and if you didn't see a video of me uh, setting up the keyboard, then I'll also put a link in the description. Um, but these two guitars here are mine, um, and the person who, uh, like, has these, um, you can see the left-handed guitars, uh, the person who has them has more guitars than me, so he's putting all of his on here, and I'm going to put my two on the wall, just because then, because you can see how the walls are really, like, playing at the minute, so I'm going to be putting my two up there, um, so I've got these um, instrument hangers, uh, the auto lock, so um, that's a good thing, how it like, locks them in, um, but as well as getting these, I got, um, what are they now, um, strap locks, that's it. Um, because on my electric guitar, oh god, it's so heavy, there's um, no like strap holder things on it and I've got a strap over there and because it's so heavy, I want to um, have a strap on it, stay, um, so I got these strap locks. So these just screw into the guitar. Get focus. And then um once you've got them in you just push them in like that and then they lock together. And then you can just take it out. I can't do this one, there we go. And that'll stay in the guitar and then you've got um your strap. So it's just more secure than like these type. They just like you just put the strap round it. So got them, but I just need a drill to drill into uh, the guitar to put the holes in because it's got no holes in it, uh, which is surprising because I thought all guitars came with um, the holders. But um, anyway, uh, gonna need a drill as well to drill them in. Um, but I might do that tomorrow. I don't know. I need to see what's going on um, so yeah I'm just gonna unbox these here my last video that I did on um, this guitar stand didn't do very well <laughs> compared to that one in 17 hours uh, the video of me doing my keyboard got 56 views and in like 15 hours the video of me doing the stand got 4 views <laughs> so yeah, uh, people like keyboard more than guitar stuff, but this is me setting up my music setup, so um, I'm doing it for a video. So it's just, I just got this off Amazon. It was like nine quid each, or eight ninety nine, whatever. Uh, I'll put a link in the description. They're just Aroma instrument hanger. Uh, so the first bike here. Oh god, well. Really. Uh, we've got two black screws. The two black screws are the ones that go into the wall. And then there's another one there. Um, you'll see what that's for in a minute. And the uh, plugs are in the wall. So it's good how it comes with everything. And then the other bit slides is one handed. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> so we've got. using my mouth so this is the uh, wall like plate kind of thing so it's good how it comes in two bits because then you've got enough room to put it in like screw it into the wall and all that and you don't have this in the way um, that little screw that's in there that you can see the little silver one it can't even focus it it doesn't want to focus today um, the little silver one is to attach them both together you can see under there, so you can like tilt this how you want. So if you put this up on the wall and it's like a bit 
to the side like that. So if you don't put it completely straight, then at least you can put the actual like hanger straight because it's got room for it. So um, this is it. So it's got like nice bar of focus on. Right, doesn't want to even auto focus. What's the camera doing? So you can see it's got padded bits at the side here, and it's got like a padded bit at the top there, which says aroma there. That's where it goes into that. So it'll be like that on your wall, and then once you don't fall, <laughs> once you put a guitar into it, this is the auto lock thing. Once you put a guitar into it, so it's going to put weight on these, it pushes it down and then them come in um, and then it keeps it like locked in so it doesn't fall out and then when you take it off, it'll obviously go down so you can pull it out so I really liked that compared to any others I had the lock thing on it so um, yeah, that's the unboxing and um, all about it um, Today is Friday, so tomorrow, Saturday, I'm gonna try and get it um, all like done, like it's drilled into the wall and screwed on. Um, but if it doesn't happen, then I'll record whenever it does happen because I don't know how long it's gonna be. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow, so so yeah, I'll see you when I uh, get to do that. Hey guys, so. Uh... Yeah, the first part of this video that you saw, that was probably like two weeks ago now, or maybe more. Um, yeah, I don't know what happened. I just didn't, I just didn't like get around to doing the wall mount. So it's literally exactly how it was before. I think I can't remember what the start of that video was like now. Um, but I've got a stand here now. I'll. And um, I'm probably really out of focus because this is where I've set it up to record me like doing it all. Um, I've got my GoPro, I'm going to do time lapse of it as well, as well as putting like bits of this in. Um, so there's two different angles. So uh, yeah, I'm going to be marking on the wall now um, where where the stand's actually going to be going so uh yeah I'm going to do that now so uh, how I'm going to mark I'm just going to get the uh the screws that it comes with it's really out of focus I'm not even in view um the screws that it comes with and I'm going to get the uh the mount I'm just going to put it like where I want it and I'm just going to like put it through the hole and dot it so uh yeah, so I'm gonna have this guitar up. Oh, I, I don't know if. I think in the beginning of the video I showed you that I got strap locks while well, they're on now, so I've got a um, strap on this guitar. I'm gonna go over here because it'll be in focus. So you can see I've got a strap on this guitar now. So, uh, yeah. Just take the strap off so it'll be easier. So uh, I think I'm gonna have that about there. I have already made a mark on, but um, I just need to put this like where that's gonna be. Alright, uh how am I gonna do this now? Right, I do already have a mark on the wall where the uh the neck uh the guitar ends. So I'm just gonna like put it there. Right, so I've got two dots now. And I've got a pencil, so I'm just going to mark them on. And the next one, 
uh, I want to have the stands level, not the bottom of the guitars level, because this one is smaller than the other one. So I want to have the um, the next level really. So the uh, the actual stands, the mounts. I mean, <laughs> so I need to figure that out somehow. <laughs> Now that uh, take this clock off. Don't actually know if I'm gonna be keeping this clock up here. I'll put it on when I'm done and see how it looks. So uh, yeah, just gonna see. Maybe like a long ruler or something. <laughs> Tells you a box. Gonna have to do. See them dots? They're about right. I'm hoping that they are fine. You won't be able to see them on the camera, but you'll see when I uh, get them up. So I'll be back when I'm starting to put them up. So I thought I'd actually update you guys because I've just watched like the intro part of the video that I recorded ages ago and noticed that I literally had like hardly anything that's here. So you saw that, like, these were set out differently. I've only uh, got mine at the end here because it's got the, uh, whatever that thing's called, I can't remember. And i got this here. It's kind of like denting, if you can see. Um, wrong way. <laughs> Them two guitars still there. There's now two amps. There's a black star one there now. And that's a box full of cables now. <laughs> Um, so loads more cables and I got loads of um, pedals now so uh, yeah um, that's that uh, oh, another thing that's like happened since did the first bit so I had, I'm pretty sure yeah I've had my um, results back for my GCSEs and I've already done um, two induction days at college so that was a long time ago <laughs> when I recorded that first bit. As you can see, I've got cards over there. Um, passed everything I need to, needed to. So that's another reason why I haven't done any videos or like got onto doing this because I've like um, been spending time doing things in uh, the uh, last few days of the holidays, and then this week. Uh, yesterday and today I had my first two days at uh, college. I went to a festival um, the weekend that's just gone as well in Liverpool. So yeah, my weekends have been like taking up my things. So that's why I haven't had time to do uh, the wall stuff. Um, so yeah, um, I will be recording again when I'm getting them on. So the screws that came with it didn't actually um, grip to the wall mount, so I could I literally could just pull it out and it was wiggling around. So we're going to find like longer and fatter screws that will like grip to the like grip to the actual mount and grip to the uh, the wall plugs um, because we don't want it just being able to pull out. So uh, yeah, hopefully we find someone that works. on that piece in you know, the back there. Thanks Debs. Uh, 
So guys, there they are, completely done. Uh, as you can see, they're on fine now. We, we did get longer screws and fatter screws for that one, but then we got different wall plugs for that one, so you can see the different screws, but you don't really notice that. So the smaller wall plug, I think the, I don't actually have them in here at the minute, the wall plugs that came with them were actually too big for the screws, so it wasn't gripping. So when we put the wall plugs in here the screws are just like pulling out straight away so now um it's fine because we got longer screws so then it grip and uh, the fatter as well so it's better but with this one we used smaller wall plugs so uh and that's then we used the screws that came with it and you see that's on fine but this guitar the acoustic guitar a lot lot lighter than that one so I wanted this one to be like really secure because it's so heavy um, and this one's just like really light so you can see this is the automatic, I'm going to do it with this because lighter this is the automatic uh, lock feature so you pull it off and you can take it out and then you put it on and it locks so I like that because then if it slides forward it doesn't come off put it back and they do swing, but that's always going to happen. And you can see there is a gap, but it's not really far away from the wall, which I like. I didn't want it to be really, really far away. So I've got the rest of my, myself in here now. Um, the person that you actually saw doing the drilling and that is the person that owns these um, two guitars. Um, so he's got more guitars to come. So that's why we got the rack because he's got more guitars than me, so does that, and then I only have two, so I put them up on the wall. Um, I do have nothing on this wall at the minute. Like the thing is, like you can see, there's holes here from things that were on the wall. I don't know if I'm gonna put my clock up. I need to see what it looks like. Um, but I need to redecorate in here and fill in them holes. And I don't know what I'm gonna put on this wall. I was thinking about soundproofing it, but I know sound like proof form is really expensive. Um, but that would just make this corner just look like amazing. So I don't know if I do it all the way across in the corner or what, but um, <clears throat> that would just make it look like completely a lot better. Um, so yeah, okay. I don't know if I do it here actually because this is where like my microphone is but I'd do it over here to make it look better because that's this is where the music is and that's what the soundproof form is for um, so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the time lapse I had a GoPro up there <laughs> I don't have a plug so 
to make sure the battery didn't run out, I got my portable charge plugged in. So, um, yeah. Um, everything is now back set up. That's just annoying me. There we go. <laughs> I'm not awesome here or anything. This is really bright. It was too bright. There we go. So, um, yeah, I'm going to be doing some more music type videos. Um, I've been learning using this keyboard a lot, like literally every day I've been going on it. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to do like a video of me playing some songs that I've learned. Um, I've been playing a bit more guitar as well, doing learning some like new techniques on it. And um, yeah, I uh, guess that's everything. I'm actually going to put the, uh, the strap on. Uh, my guitar and see what it looks like up on the wall with the strap on. That's it with the strap on. I'm just uh... Uh, so I don't know how I feel about it about that. Maybe if I did it the other way around, so then this bit wasn't here, then it'd be better. Um, I might try that, but it looks all right, and I could just take it straight off and put it like on. I'm actually gonna put the clock up and see what it looks like. This clock I've had for years, it's just like a mini clock. I don't know if I'm going to keep it up there, get a new clock, put it in a different place, whatever, because I actually look at this clock a lot. Seeing as I've got like a Fitbit on my wrist, I've got my phone, I've got my computer, all that with times on it, I always look at this clock because it's been there literally ever since I've had this room, so since I was really, really young. So um, I just... I'm just used to it being up there, and I just look at it because it's just I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't like actual watches. I like this. You can't see because it's not focused. I like that. God, I like this kind of time. So it says like 9:39, but for in here, I just I don't know. I can read this better. But if I need an exact time, I just look at um, my Fitbit. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video with time lapse stuff in it. If you guys want to see more videos, suggest like this, suggest uh, video ideas in the comments for music type stuff. Um, I haven't recently got it, a set of Corsa. Um, this is going way off music, but I've already done 23 hours on it. Um, I need to do. A, I'm gonna do a video on that because my driving videos do really good. Um, so that's gonna be coming soon, and I'm gonna do some other games because I'm all, at the minute all my videos have just been music and driving games. So uh, yeah, um, guess we're just gonna see what. <laughs> just gonna have to see what videos uh, come up. Um, so yeah, um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.